time to go back to the ark. Yeah, I had to sleep at the inn because it feels like I have too much time and I don't really have anything to do. So I'm just running around checking if there's any new NPCs or something. Oh. <laughs> Sid Reigns. Did not expect to see that him. was once a man's name, but now it means nothing. But pleasant his surprise. Soul has dissolved into the swirl of chaos. I take his form as a convenience, but I'm no more than a puppet. All right. So who's pulling your strings, Benavelza? No, not God. I am the voice of many of the countless multitude who call chaos home. I am the speaker for the dead. Tell me, Savior. Do you know the ritual they call Soul Song? Vanille is planning to perform it at the cathedral. She says it'll release the dead from their suffering. I guess that means you. Vanille has been misled. There is a truth she cannot see. I knew a it. A truth that lies within the unseen realm. What do you mean? What truth? You do not understand the role of chaos. Huh. Hmm? The chaos will drown this world, but it's also the key to our humanity. When we die, we return to it, but only for a short time. And then what happens? When a man dies, his soul melts into the chaos, but the idea of it, of him, survives intact. And then he is reborn anew and returns to the living world. But what? An unseen power exists in all of us. It's the chaos that we carry in our hearts. So you mean it's not all that bad, the chaos? Our souls are made out of the chaos, which is why they return to it when we die. But how can we be reborn? There, waiting for a new body, which means you could be reborn in the new world. If the Sacred One shows us the way, she is the only one who can tell us what to do. She has the power to guide us into the future where we can live again. She can do what I can't. Vanille can bring salvation to the dead. Yes, but she doesn't know what she is capable of. The Order has kept the truth from her. Why would they lie to her? They preach salvation. Only for the living. The Soul Song will destroy us and make you forget we ever existed. Okay, we don't want that. Neither on a grand scale. You want me to stop her, right? Yes. And then you must tell her what her real power is, so she can lead us to salvation. Is this what you all want? It is, but it is not God's will. If you answer our prayer, it will mean defying Bonavelza. I'm game. Those who try to defy the gods end up controlled by them and are destroyed in the end. Like Sid Reigns. I remember Reigns fought for humanity and he was killed for it, but the spirit that drove him to stand up to the tyranny of the gods didn't die. I kept it with me. Chaos is in all of us. It's the stuff our souls are made of, and it's the reason that the dead live on in our hearts and minds. Yes. The chaos unites humanity, a thread woven through all our lives, and it's a power God cannot see. Its potential is limitless, and that makes it more powerful than he is. Interesting. Now you're gonna tell me that it's nearly impossible to tap into. Am I right? Yet it is possible. No one can control the chaos. If you want to make the power yours, you must have the help of those who are inside it. You know what needs to be done. You know whose soul you have to find. Sarah? You mean Sarah? Are you saying I'll be able to reach her? You must. With the because that's the part possible, she's missing. Find the invisible bonds that unite us across life and death. Do that and you will have all the power you need. Interesting, but the Lumina is also within the chaos. It was nice to see you see it. Chaos. It was the key to defeating God. If I wanted to use it, I needed Sarah's help. 
But Sarah, how can I make you hear me? I reach out with every fiber of my being, but is it enough? Can I do more? If I throw myself into the abyss, if I cry out to you, will you hear me, Sarah? Will you answer? So, they're all a piece of the chaos. That is very interesting. So in that case, it can be somewhat Hold the controlled. World aloft. Give me another day. Hmm, very interesting. Well, it's that time again. I wonder if Lumina knows something. Something she could probably tell us. Wake has been unlocked. No more outfits? Hmm? Light, the end is almost here. One more day, and then the destruction of the world will be complete. Right. And there's no way I can delay it any longer. No. This is it. You can still carry out your mission as the savior, but today is your last chance. Tomorrow in the cathedral, Vanille will perform the soul song for the Order. The final rites when the souls of the dead will be released from their torment and returned to oblivion. And when the clock strikes the hour, it'll mark the end of everything. It's an ending that not even God has the power to stop. Ooh. Tell me something. You said that the souls of the dead return to the chaos, right? If that's true, then that's where Sarah must be. Her soul is lost out there in the chaos somewhere. For God, the chaos is an unseen realm. He cannot see inside. And so it follows that he doesn't have the power to find her as long as she is in the chaos. But he can do something else. He can make her anew. But then how can she be the real Sarah? The one I know? I don't well, like that. Don't you trust him? It's true that even with all his power, God cannot extract Sarah's soul from the chaos. So, but there is what are we doing then? He might find it. He could take her soul from inside of you. How would... You're just making things up now. You always found it hard to trust people. What chance does God have? Look, I'm not saying you will, but if you do decide to turn against him, you should know that I'll always stand with you. You trust me, don't you? Yes, I do. <laughs> but why aren't you turning it toward us? Like the more I search, the further away I get from finding her. I've encountered more than a few ghosts from the past now, talked to souls from the chaos even, but I'm still no closer to finding Sarah. Not even a hint. I don't know, but perhaps you've done everything you can. Maybe you could have found her already, but something is keeping her from talking to you. Like she doesn't want to see me? Is that what you're saying? Of course I don't think that's the case. But it's possible. Perhaps it's because you're too close to each other. You mean she's out there and can talk to other people, but not me. Tell you what, why don't you go out there and look for her in my place? I'd like to help, Light. But I can't leave the Ark. How about this? If I happen to die before you do, for whatever reason, I'll make you a promise. Don't say I'll that. I'll try to find her in the chaos. And when I do, I'll find some way for you two to be together again. Oh my god, he's so nice. You are the best. But please don't sacrifice yourself. Hey, we match. <laughs> we are matching pretty darn good. So, Sid Reigns is like the advocate of the dead. It really feels like the end now. Soon it'll be over. <sighs> it's been dying for 500 years. I wasn't talking about the world. Then what? Never mind. Time is short. Every minute's precious now. Let's not waste any. Hope? What the frick do you mean? Why do I have a bad feeling about this? Oh, he better not mean that he will go away. No, no, no. That, that, that cannot happen. We are gonna have a happy ending. I really hope so. Losing hope? No, I don't even want to think about it. Mm-mm. Mm -mm -mm. I have special powers I use it. 
That's gonna be a no. We won't let that happen. Ever. He's done too much. To just disappear. No. Will not let that happen. Thanks for dropping in. I wanted a taste of the expensive dishes. It was very nice seeing Sid Reigns again. Him being the advocate of the dead. The dead that are just swimming around in the chaos. The soul song will destroy these souls. So they will not be reborn an anew. But they are waiting to be reborn. And Bunivelze could like show them to the new world, possibly, but he cannot see the chaos, he cannot hear the chaos. But he also thinks that the souls of the dead are unclean. That's the kind of information we got from the, from the murals, so... It just seems like he does not want those souls to be reborn. Like, if you've already died, you're not coming along. That's that's the feeling I get with Bunivelta. It's like, nope, nope, can do, but Vanille, she's the sacred one. So she will be able to lead them. What will you be needing? I don't know, what do you have? Okay, nothing. It has been I'm searching for garbs. Not that I don't have any, but you know, can't get enough of garbs, right? <laughs> and also searching for NPCs that might possibly show up and maybe snow? Hmm. I only met him that one time and then never again. Hmm. Interesting. Thank you for coming. Sleep until te 12. We'll see if someone appears. I don't know. I mean, we have a couple of quests, but that is from the prayer board. And then we still have this potion quest. Mm. And then we have that sheep quest, which we cannot finish because the sheep just don't want to move. Maybe it would have worked if we could just like abandon the quest and take it again. Maybe that would would have like reset it. But I don't think we can abandon a quest that we have taken. Also, Sid Reigns was never a bad guy. There was, you could uh, we've got to find think that maybe he was, sort of. We already had this. But when you got to know his motivation and his ambition, it was, his morals were in the right place. Let me just say that. He was one of the good guys. And he basically was held as a hostage by Barthandalus. It was Barthandalus, right? Not Bartholomew. Bartholomew was Hope's father, right? I kind of mix them, mix them up together sometimes. Fun. Do me next. <laughs> Maybe we're too heavy, especially with this sword. Why don't we go work with the volunteers? Because lightning is not heavy. 
but he's rather skinny, so that would be an easy task. But maybe it's her willpower that is heavy. <laughs> I wonder what Biggs and Wedge are doing. Well, th right, they're not here anymore because they're doing music. You wanna fight? Uh, of course I got hit before. This one is so fun. Look at this. Amazing. I might actually sleep away this day as well. I just need to look around to see that we're not missing anything. But we did something that is very important, and that is saving dodge and sass. Very, very, very important. I would have just restarted the whole game, looked up a guide, just so I could save them. If I had to. Like, there's no way I would have abandoned them. Mm -mm, not a chance. Oh. Well, that was quick. Uh, I think I, I had a quest here somewhere. Don't really remember what it was. Was it something with a firework or a book? Well, Sid basically was held as a hostage in the first game, but he was a good guy. Everything he did, he did for the citizens of Cocoon. He just wanted to save them. So in a sense, he really is a hero. It was really nice seeing him again. And I hope that we can save him as well. It feels empty now without Fang. I would have loved to just run around with her. Also, I really hope that we get some romantic scenes between uh, Vanille and Fang. I would really love that. Like, Fang doesn't seem like the romantic type, but I feel like with Vanille, she would totally be the romantic type. Because she really does whatever it takes to save Vanille. A man who once defied the orders of the gods and hoped to set mankind free. He died an unnatural unnat death while working towards his goal. This goal. General Reigns was a military man working for Cocoon's guardian corps. He wished to defeat the false sea, powerful servants of the gods, and return to humanity, con humanity control of its own fate. He lost that fight, and in the cruel irony that God so loved, he was turned into a puppet for the false e. He faced lightning as an enemy, when they should have been allies. Oh my gosh! <laughs> that is so true, but we can be allies right now, right? Oh, look at him. He's gorgeous. <laughs> He may have met a tragic end, but his wish to see the people free lived on in those who followed after him. 
or lightning, Reigns was both a bitter enemy and a comrade in the great fight against the gods. Yeah, we're we're definitely gonna turn on Bunibel's it. We we've had too many pushes into that direction right now. So I'll be flabbergasted if it doesn't go that way. The dead all lived once, but now they are returned to the chaos. And out of the chaos came Sid Reigns to speak on their behalf. He revealed a startling truth. Vanil has the power to summon the souls of the dead and lead them on to the new world. The power to save the dead. It is a power that even the savior herself does not possess. But Vanil, in the hands of the Order, is determined instead to perform the soul song and erase all of the lost souls from existence. That we do not want to happen, especially not now since we got to know from Reigns that that is not what we should be doing. Reigns told Lightning that she must make the millions of dead her allies if she wishes to defeat God in battle. He instructed her to entrust them with her wishes, through her bond with the one person she loves above all others. She needs Sarah to do this thing for her, but she still does not know where Sarah's soul has gone. <sighs> How are we gonna find it? We need help from the people of the chaos. And it just feels like... The one who might truly know might be Lumina. I have a feeling since she is just like pestering lightning all the time. Just comes up whenever she wants to. And just drops some boiling hot tea every single time and we're like go on and then she just leaves us on, on a cliffhanger all the time. So there must be something that she knows. She is... She is a key character to obtaining Sarah's soul. That's what I believe. I could be totally wrong, but... I think just the story and the dialogue, the scenes we've seen... point to that. I mean, we could get totally blindsided, of course, and that would be totally okay with me. Anyone have any recommendations? Either way, it'll be very interesting. Welcome. I think we're gonna do some sleeping. Maybe two eighteen. That's. Let's see if someone appears. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just, you know, passing time. Safe journeys. One day left. Did we? I don't know. Are we? Do we need to be at the church? Huh. Maybe we do need to be at the church. Or is there like a day zero? Maybe there is a day zero. The train is arriving. Passengers bound for Luxarian North Station. The train. This train. We're going to Luxarian. Gonna check the church. Mm, probably, maybe Luca is somewhere. Maybe she appeared. You never know. But wait, she wasn't in the north station. Was it south? Mm, I don't remember. No, she was at the south station. You heading into battle? <laughs> you heading into battle? No one is telling me how pretty I am with this monk outfit. When I see the ocean, I get a terrible urge to jump in. Uh, please don't. I mean, 
can you swim? And even if you can swim, what if it's really cold? And you might not even make it. We're here for all. Will you be taking? People should really respect um, respect the ocean, respect the water in general. It can be very dangerous, even if you know how to swim. Here in Sweden, we're teached uh, to swim very early on. Like when we're babies, they just like teach us how to float first. <laughs> there isn't anywhere and then in school. Ooh. Almost got snatched. Is there a rare forge here somewhere? I know it. That maybe sells some clothes. Hmm. I don't know. What if I can't even get inside anymore? I thought it almost said locked. It is indeed. How is Vanille feeling? When we're gonna explain this to Vanille, she will not perform the soul song. The hunter finally revealed his real name, Noel. <laughs> Have you guys seen him? <laughs> what is he up to? Noel and Fang have very similar clothing. And also they could be siblings. Where's Vanille? Meet the beautiful woman that said to have solved the case. Th that is uh, us. <laughs> hmm. We are done with every main quest. Order plans to use the clavis. Yes. Maybe we do need to sleep away the day. I, I, I would just wait. I don't know. I don't know if something's gonna happen. So, I'll just wait here. Just be careful with the, the candlelight. Okay? Let me... Come on. I just wanted to stand in the middle. Oh, oh, oh that was dangerous. Dangerous place for the candle to be. Can we sit? Oh, oh, what? oh, Did you see that? Leg up. There we go. No! <laughs> that looks funny. <laughs> oh. Okay, soon it's midnight. I'm just gonna see if she appears. I really want to talk with Vanille, and she might have something to say. Hello, Vanille. Bye. Okay, not here. I want to see their reunion. Okay, maybe we'll just head to the inn again and do some more sleeping. When we just have a day left, or more like six hours of this day. The music is so ominous in this place. You can hear this like piano. What is it called? I only know the Swedish world. word. Is there no bards here singing? Yeah, there's a bard here. Avid reader. But 
he's not singing. Oh, yes he is. We must be alert to every threat. But we are gonna go and sleep. Welcome to our There we go. Maybe we'll get another cutscene. Well, now we're on day zero. <laughs> it almost looked like he was gonna twirl. <laughs> I was waiting for it. I was like... <laughs> hmm. Disappointed. Maybe we'll see a twirl from Hope instead. <laughs> oh, we don't have any Eradia. We're just here to look at the tree. On this final day, please hear my last prayer. Where did you pull that out from? We didn't do anything. Did we? This is it. This is the true light of Yggdrasil. Ah, uh, what? Where does it say one day? Well, it's that time again. Did I get another day? How? What did I do? Equilibrium plus, Dark Muse plus, uh, Mist Wizard plus, they've been upgraded. What does that mean? Are they like much much better? Ooh. Where's the other one? Mist Wizard Element 4. Oh my gosh. Where, 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 where's the other ones? Maybe we have them on a schema and that's why we can't see them. Probably. Uh, equilibrium. Was it the savior outfit? Because then that's pretty darn cool. Because I wanted to wear that. There it is. Plus, this is the one. Let's just do that. This is so extremely cool. Greatly hastens the ATP. Ah! <laughs> Wonderful! Oh my gosh, she looks so cool. I think that Lightning's... Lightning's character design is definitely, hands down, one of the best I've seen. With the savior out outfit. I'm like... But she looks absolutely fantastic in every single one of the outfits, but the savior one... So it's day 13. That means the end of the world. That's what you said, right? Yes, but something has changed. I don't quite understand it. The Tree of Life has borne more fruit, and it's glowing with a light that I've never seen before. I'm not sure, but I think this might be the lost time. We're getting it back, here at the end. What do you mean? Remember when I told you about the clocks? I told you how they only count to 12 instead of 13. Yeah. There used to be 26 hours in a day. But now there are only 24. Two hours less. And the clocks changed when the chaos was unleashed. You think that the lost time still existed somewhere? Yes. Through a tear in the fabric of space-time, perhaps. But now it's come back. Thanks to you. I think it was the excess Aradia that you harvested. Somehow, you accumulated so much that the distortion in the space-time was repaired, and we got back all those missing hours from the last 12 days. 
That's 24 we didn't have. Which means we've been given a reprieve one more day before God awakens and the final destruction begins. Just the one day. It's not a lot of time. Yes, but it's enough for what I want you to do. I detected a previously unknown ruin deep in the dead dunes. Its oh. appearance coincided with the return of the lost time. Oh. Okay, where is that? Um, uh, dead dunes, you said. Should we just go there? <gasps> the Eradia that Lightning gave forth from herself went uh, beyond even what God had foreseen. Giving rise to a distortion in time and re reinstating the lost 13th hours. A day which never should have existed now does, and brought with it a place that does not belong in this dimension. In the extra day before the end, a mysterious new ruin has appeared in the dead dunes. The ultimate lair. Oh, what is this? And can I please say I can teleport there? Yeah, I was just like thinking, what should I do with this extra day? Now we know. Hope seems to think that lightning might learn some new truths by exploring these ruins. You can reach the ultimate lair from the new warp point that has appeared near the temple ruins east gate. Uh huh. Yes, we're gonna go there. It's not like we have anything else to do anyway. Like, for example, save, save the souls of the dead. <laughs> now wait, we we're gonna go there soon. I just need to go to the, this ultimate layer because it might have some kind of ultimate treasure. <laughs> The ultimate lair is an unknown ruin born from a lost dimension. In this place alone, time does not stop during battles. Will you be able to reach the deepest levels within the limited amount of time you have available to you? What? How many floors? Making your way through the labyrinth, keep moving downward to reach the deepest levels. As you defeat the enemies on each level, you will gain access to warp devices that lead to lower lower floors. The, enemy are, the enemies are all last ones. If you already drove a particular species into extinction, those species will not appear. With a higher battle score, you can jump several floors deeper. You cannot use chronostasis in this ruin. I see. You can continue deeper or turn back. The choice is yours. Defeat the most terrible of beasts and dispatch dispatch the ultimates into oblivion. I do have a quest though with the last ones, so the hole created in space at that time, the figurative eye of the chaos storm. That is this labyrinth. It's thought to be a holy land, a place of God, beyond human imagining. Maybe this is where God's hiding. I wouldn't be surprised if that were to be true. There's more energy what? than I can explain. It's hard to even trust my sensors. Maybe it really is God. What? So I do need to make, make it to the lower level. <laughs> oh my gosh, why did I do that? Well, I don't have it, but I can stagger you. Oh, it's gonna take some... some time. Huh. So, physical attacks. Let's go! Hmm. We have a lot of ATP. 170 on the monk and equilibrium also have 170. That is amazing. I'm gonna try to make it to the deepest level, but it also depends on how much time it's gonna take. You can't use chronostasis. And 
and it feels like I'll be switching up schemas pretty often too. Since it's gonna be all the last ones. I can imagine some of them being really difficult. <laughs> She's so cool. Defeated every hoplite. Frostward Bangle. Give me more items! Mm, mm. If they drop items, and really good items at that, I don't really wanna miss any of the floors, so... What would be the point of me just going three floors down? Huh? Okay, this one is extinct. I'm guessing it might look the same every floor. How many floors are there? If it takes too long, then maybe I won't. Ooh! Ooh, let's try. <laughs> Maybe I should have saved. Just because the time moves when when we fight. Didn't do much. <laughs> I love it. We're just moving around this heavy ass dragon like it's nothing. Slice. They didn't just guard my attacks while it was lying down. <laughs> Maybe I won't even have time to make it down. Yeah, this is gonna take a long time. I'm not doing much damage. I might need to schema for the next big enemy. I spent a lot of time fighting in that freaking dungeon. A lot of time. Like, I was there for like three hours. Okay, maybe not three hours. This is it, Light. There's no more time left. It's the last day of the world. Right. Vanille will be getting ready to perform the soul song. 
She's going to liberate the dead and release them from their suffering and despair. Hey, Light. When Vanille saves the dead, what'll happen to me? Hope. What's going on? What about my soul? Oh my God! What? 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 what, what, what? Don't tell me. Bunivelsi is keeping him hostage, like for real hostage. And he's like outside of being safe. No, 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 no. I will not think about that. We, we, we have to be able to save him. The light of my life, let it be redeemed at last. Because if we can't save Hope, the ending, whatever the ending might be, it's not a happy ending because we need to be able to save him. I'm gonna freaking cry. Oh? Uh? Light. <gasps> Hope. What is this? I've come to say goodbye. No! How did you... It's too late for me now. I had a job. That was God's eyes and ears, made to watch over everything you did. But now the last day is here, and God doesn't need me anymore. But we need you. I'll just disappear. No. God no. just doesn't like leaving loose ends. This was always his plan. Bonavelza, he's going to just cast you aside? It's his way. It's we save you. harder than I thought it would be, but he still needs you, and you can help the others. Will you do that for me? We will save you. Neil intends to go through with the soul song and throw her life away. But she won't be the only one who dies. That ceremony is going to destroy all those souls, yet she has the power to lead them to the new world. We need to tell her, and we need yes. to save hope. She doesn't know what she is or what she can do. You have to tell her. I know her. As long as she knows the truth, she'll do the right thing. Yes, she will. And then, you'll have a choice to make, too. It'll be your only chance to save Sarah. I've got to find her soul if I want to save her. And the truth is, I just can't feel her anymore. <sighs> It'll be all right. Trust me. She can see you, and she's been watching over you. When you make the right choice, You'll find her again. The right choice? <sighs> Tough call for someone who can't stop repeating past mistakes. It'll be easy. You just have to imagine what kind of world Sarah would want. What kind of person she wants you to be. Do that, and the answer will be clear. <sighs> but that's the problem, don't you see? Maybe once I knew her well enough to know what she would want. Something's happened to my soul. I can't see people's hearts anymore, not even my sister's. You don't have to give up. Overcoming your mistakes, that's the key. It doesn't matter how many times you fail, if you succeed in the end. So keep trying, okay? I'm off to a bad start. I didn't make the effort to understand you. I didn't trust you and instead hid everything from you. No, that was the right thing to do. That wasn't the real me, and he was never someone you should have trusted. He was just a pawn in God's game. What are you saying? I'm sorry. Don't be. At least I've had this chance to be myself again, here at the very end. After all that's happened, it's enough. Do you remember when we first met all those centuries ago? Do you remember what you told me then? Keep your eyes front. I'll watch the rear. But I didn't. I couldn't. <sighs> oh, but you did. More times than you know. As long as you were with me, Light, I didn't have to fear anything. This is not, not goodbye. Scared. Not even now. Because you're here. No, no, no.
Nope, this is not the end. We will see him. No, 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 this was not... This was not a farewell. Can I just stop acting up? Oh no! This is so, so depressing! Hope, you've gone and left me behind. We have to find him. Or was it the other way around? Was it me who left you? something and how, how are you here let me just see what hope left me what are you doing here i can't leave you all alone koopo Aww. i have a message for you koopo and here it is no matter what happens keep your eyes front and in the meantime, you've got my back, right? <laughs> you've got it, like Koopa! <laughs> what is it? I'm depressed! <laughs> I want the hope back. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just confused now. What if we can't save him? There's nothing about hope. It's time for the last battle, Koopa! It is. At the beginning of the final day, Vanille will start to perform the soul song. The ritual will guide the souls of the living to the new world, but the burden will be too much for her. Vanille will die. She will, Koopa? But that can't happen, Koopa! She's being used by the Order. She doesn't need to perform the Soul Song. She has the power to save the souls of the living and dead. Oh, does that mean she can save Sarah too, Koopa? I think so, if Hope is telling the truth. If I can grant her wish and make it true, then she'll come back at last. At least that's what he said. But God himself wants Vanille to complete that ceremony. If I stop her, I'll be defying his will. Then I don't know what will happen to Sarah. I know what Sarah would say, Kubo. She wouldn't hesitate. She'd say, do what's right. Help save all the souls. Yes, I know. She's always been like that. If someone needs saving, she just goes ahead and does it. No matter how dangerous it is to her. Yeah. Sounds like Vanille. Just like your big sister, Kubo. <laughs> and that's why... That's why I'm worried about you too, Koopa. Don't worry, Mog. I'll be fine. I'm going to do what Sarah would want me to do, what she'd tell me to do. I'll make her wish come true, and she'll come back. <sighs> Ready for the final day. Also, did anyone else get the feeling that when we had the, the cutscene with, with Hope and Lightning, it just felt like the resolution scene with Aerith in remake. And when when Lightning just reached out to him. Exactly what Cloud did towards Aerith, but he couldn't grab her. Lift your voices in prayer, children of the light. Come gather ye to the final place. Pray to the Savior, she heralds the end. Praise to God in all his great glory, for he built a paradise anew. Chaos? Oh, damn. <laughs> Run! 
Run! Uh oh. Y'all are cooked now. But it's okay. You can all be saved. Looking flawless. It's the beginning of the end. Time has run out on this world. And there won't be any more tomorrows. Life and death are one and the same now. These are the dying moments, and soon, life will just come to a stop. They all have to die now. It's the only way they can reach the brave new world. But not everyone gets to take the journey. According to the Order, salvation is a privilege reserved for a select few. The people who died in the past are going to be erased forever, like they never existed. The trouble is, though, the souls of the dead are bound to the memories of the living. Because we remember them, they can survive in the chaos. We're custodians, and our job is to keep the flame of memory burning. That's why the souls don't just melt into the chaos, because they're still remembered by us. They have an identity that keeps them alive. But if we yeah. forget them, they're gone forever with no hope of coming back. And it works the other way, too. If the soul of a dead person is destroyed, then our memories of that person disappear, too. Gone from our minds like they never were. Imagine forgetting everyone who once lived. It's more final than any mass murder. But... That's exactly what the Order is going to do with the Soul Song. The Neil has the power to summon all the souls to her. When she does, the Order will use the Clavis to destroy them. When it preaches purification, that's what the Order really means. But why would they wipe out the past? To get rid of all the sadness and uncertainty. All those regrets that hold us back and make us weak. They want us to start with a clean slate, so we can be strong in our bold new world. And you know what? That's what God wants, too. Does Vanille know all this? Not all of it. The Order's kept her in the dark. As far as she knows, she's just releasing the dead from their suffering. She doesn't realize that when she does this, not only will the dead disappear, but so will our memories of them. Just keep me in your thoughts. Remember me. And we'll see each other again. No matter what happens to me. Even if I vanish from this world. Promise me, Lightning. Promise you'll remember me. If this ritual happens as the Order wants, my memories of Sarah will disappear. And when that happens, I'll lose any hope I had of bringing her back. Mm-hmm. Yep. She'll be gone forever. <sighs> then there's only one thing to do. I have to get into the Cathedral and stop that ritual. <laughs> exactly. Oh, what are you doing, Lumina? What are you doing? <laughs> Don't go! I have to. I'm out of time. Don't take everyone with you. She's gonna be alone. Don't I knew leave it. me all alone. <laughs> oh shit, that's so sad. Now I feel bad for her. I had a feeling that... Daniel, please, you will open your eyes. The Soul Song saves no one. The Order can't save the dead. That's something only you can do. You and only you have the power to guide those Lumina? souls into the future. I have to get to the Cathedral before the ceremony starts. Where is she? She's going to be all alone. Because there will be no one else, and she'll just be stuck in the chaos. The final day arrived, and Hope showed Lightning the path she must take. He told her that Sarah is watching over her. If Lightning can lead the people to the world that should be, he is sure that Sarah will return to her. With those last words, Hope disappeared. <laughs> 
No, what is happening? And just look at Lumina. Oh, she's so sad. We have never seen her so desperate. Down on the surface, the soul song was beginning. Believing Hope's assurance that stopping the ceremony will bring Sarah back to her, Lightning headed for the cathedral. Along the way, she encountered Lumina, who told her that the soul song is meant to wipe the dead from history, making it so that they never existed in the first place. With an even greater conviction that she must stop this ceremony, Lightning set off at a run. Lumina remained where she was left unnoticed by any as she began to fade into the chaos <gasps> you guys this is extremely sad and it just feels like she bonded with lightning even though she could be a little bit of a brat he bonded with lightning. <laughs> and there... I still think there's a reason why... Why she looks so similar to lightning and... To Sarah. We can't just leave her here, right? We can't save her too, right? Like, what if... Lumina is like the the unborn sister that they never had and something like that. <laughs> Someone that they didn't know of. <laughs> Nearly got wiped out there. These guys did become much stronger. We need to stop the soul song. But why did she vanish? And did you see that glow she had? It reminded me of the same glow that Sarah and Hope had. Gosh, this went really bad. Don't ask me what I'm doing. A prayer for souls. to use my potions because we don't know what's waiting for us at the cathedral I increases ATP recovery by 10. I need this. And I kind of need this one too. Let's just buy these as well. <laughs> they were sheep. Thank you. What do you want? Mm -hmm, you have X potions. And I have loads of money. <laughs> I'm gonna switch this one out. Oh, oh, oh. This is pretty, y'all. <laughs> uh, what do I want to wear? Mm, I mean, I want to wear them all, but this one is good. This one is real good. But I also want to wear that nightmare outfit. Mm. Mm. 
ATB charge level 3. This is pretty. But this? <laughs> oh my! Could we maybe do this one? Uh, we kind of have to wear it. Some... Some fights. But which one should I switch out? Should I switch out the martial monk? Yes. Let's do that. We got some debuff. The protect, maybe? I really like the protect and the shell. But we don't really know what kind of enemies will be there. Hum, hum, hum. But we are gonna kick butt in a bikini. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> we'll do that. Let's go! There we go, y'all are deep protected! Work much better! than before. Seems like it's gonna be challenging. That's fine by me. Why did you want to backstab me like that? Did you see that? It kinda debuffed the enemy. I didn't really check what that did. Wait, there's two general stores? are plenty angry. because people remember them. So if, basically, if uh, Lightning would stop remembering Sarah, like she wouldn't have any memories of Sarah, that would mean that Sarah's soul would be done for. Like she would not exist in the chaos anymore. What do you want? Eh, more potions. I don't know how many I need. 
Let's go. <laughs> oh, do you hear the chanting? Uh-huh. Let's just buy all of them. Those are super cheap. And we're super rich. What kind of forge? Ooh. Oh, pretty! Oh my god, that is so pretty. Ooh, these are good. Cool. have enough money to buy all of these but this one is so pretty <laughs> it's super pretty oh oh my that's incredible that is super pretty Hurry up! Uh, I don't know how prepared we have to be. It just feels like there's gonna be a massive fight when we enter. And like it's not just gonna be the sentinels. Or sentry guards. But I really hope that we can stop Vanille in time. There's just a lot I wish to do. I want to save Hope, I want to save Vanille, I want to save everyone, but also now Lumina. I didn't care for Lumina that much before, but I feel it's so bad. Like, she's obviously important. The is not to let anyone in, no matter who they might be. I am to use any means to strike down anyone who would interfere with the sacred rites. You could try. Fool. You try to fight me, you die. Do your worst. Look around us, would you? It's the end of the world, and we're all dead anyway. Or didn't you notice? We've been waiting hundreds of years for this day to come. We will gladly give up our lives for God. For God Almighty! Then you're fools. Because if you die now, you won't get to the new world because that's not what Bunivelza wants you to do. If you died once, you should just not exist anymore. That's his philosophy. A gift of life. See, I told you not to mess with me. And you still do. It really does do the siren strike. It does debuff the the enemy. That's interesting, but only when striked it seems like. How oh, dare you shoot at a lady? Okay, I just want to get inside so I can see Vanille's and Fang's reunion, okay? Uh, 
And if Fang is in there, how how did she manage to get in there? Well, probably because Vanille would have let her in. She'd be like, y'all better leave my girlfriend be. Ominous. Look at this. What a menacing sound. It's just like very dark. Oh, oh. The freak! A chimera! <laughs> Oh, I knew we were fighting. This doesn't look right. The Shadow Hunter! Here? <laughs> You're the servant of God. Aren't you supposed to be on the Order's side? I'm not a servant of these fanatics. They want to go through with their damn ritual, and I'm here to stop them. If that means a fight, so be it. But the ritual is God's plan, right? You're going to defy him as well? Yeah, maybe I am. <laughs> That's a hell of an admission. Do you care? God brought you back to save souls and show them the way to the new world. It's a sacred mission. And there's only one thing in the world that would make you turn your back on it. Lightning. I know why you're going to betray God. <laughs> it has to do with Sarah, always. <laughs> You think you can save Sarah? Wait, they're together! Run! Don't let her escape! Lightning! So cool! But where is Fang? Where is Fang? Uh, no? Can you really handle two of those? Do not sacrifice yourself. <laughs> I hope that doesn't mean that he won't be coming back. No, we are gonna have no, a happy ending. I promise I won't let your wishes die here. Oh my gosh. Dryad, but this one looks different. Archangel. Oh, you got elements. <laughs> Imperial. What? What the heck was that? What's it doing? Okay, seems to take some time. Whoa, Are you shooting me? That was freaking dangerous. Okay, let's not let him do that again. Maybe you can perfect guard it. fighting together both on the same side <laughs> I'm gonna be so sad if there's not a happy ending 
this trilogy needs a happy ending. Oh. A bittersweet a sweet ending is like it's always good, you know, it's nice. But these characters have been through so much crap. I just want them to be happy. Like, please let them be happy. Yeah, this guy is not gonna do any wings of judgment on me. Not gonna let you. I can't be late. I have to make it. <laughs> it's so sad that we're not hearing hearing hope anymore. I was about to say Chadley. We're just talking with ourselves. I really love that cutscene with uh, lightning and hope. Just so wholesome and really sad. I got a lot of Cloud and Air with the vibes from that. are here? Oh, oh, you look meaner than usual now. Uh-huh, you get healed up from something. Doesn't matter. Oh, okay, it's fire. Come on. Even if you get healed up, I'm still quicker. Wendigo. Isn't that from some kind of like urban legend? Folklore. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I tricked you into turning around so I could take this fear. I mean, these monkeys, they don't do that much damage than that Dryad looking thingy. At least, it seems like it doesn't summon like 10 other friends. It looks exceptionally good with Caius's sword. <laughs> it looks amazing. Looks better than the Amazon one. <laughs> oh, they're kind of similar to one another, but I think I like the Nightmare one more. What? Looks Someone beat me to the party. <gasps> Bang is here. Where is she? Where is she? Oh my gosh. Where is she? I'm already starting to fangirl. Where are you? Great. The dead are being summoned already. The uh -oh. chanting is getting louder. 
I must be getting close. We need to stop it. <laughs> well, at least Fang will be there before us. And if Vanille is gonna listen to someone, it feels like the two of us, yes. She didn't really listen to Fang. Because Vanille knows that Fang would do anything to keep Vanille, Vanille alive. And even if Vanille would do something wrong, Fang would still be on her side. Like she is a ride or die. So Vanille knows that whatever Fang would say or do would be for the best for Vanille. And not for everyone else. So hearing something from Lightning as well would probably just solidify that Fang was right not to trust these fanatics. fanatics. She's gonna know what Soul Song is really about. I'm gonna have to run around this place and just see if there's other spheres. Because this feels a little bit like a labyrinth. to find all the spheres. Samurai's comb. Ooh. Where is it? Ah, oh, increases strength and magic by 10%. Oh, I've got a lot of good accessories. Okay, you guys, that's gonna be it for today because i've played more than one hour because i was uh, in the ultimate layer for a bit too long although i got some really good accessories that maybe will be good in the upcoming fights we'll just have to see uh, but i never really got down to the final the lowest of the floors so hmm i do have a save there so i might go back and check if it's worth it like is it is it something that has to do with bonivelzo or is it just something else hmm is it worth it you guys should i should i not okay that's it for today thank you all for watching bye